Now this might be the coolest car you've never heard of. This is the Aura Cat and I think it looks quite interesting. So let's take a look in the inside first because the inside is really surprising. So this car, depending on how you spec it, should cost around 30,000 euros. But the quality inside, at least in this particular version, is amazing. Hang on, I just have to turn the stereo down a little bit. The switches, they feel sort of like mini quality. They even look a little bit like in the mini. You have, yes, a little bit of hard plastic, but you have really soft materials on top. You have a really good, just generally just really good infotainment system. And your display in the front. So we can see that a lot of stuff that we used to think of cheap cars in the past has really changed. Technology had, has advanced and actually made cheap cars high quality. Now, it's also surprising how much room there is. So the whole thing looks a little bit like the VW Beetle, some might say. I think I can see some of that. And that allows a fairly high roof, which means that you have a lot of space in the front for your head and for your head in the back. And it also has a really nice long wheelbase, which actually is due to the electric platform. Obviously you have your batteries in the floor and you can stretch that out. You don't really need space for an engine. So you can design the car in an interesting way and allow for a lot of space on the inside. I think we still have to look on the exterior design a little bit more because I'm not sure we've really fully seen that. It's really kind of unique in many ways, so it has a lot of features from cars of the past. I already mentioned VW Beetle, maybe a little bit of Porsche, maybe a little bit of Mini. Now you have this very unusual rear design. As you can see, there's no, no lights here. Very clean. It also looks a bit unexpected so you think it might be a coupe from the front and then you go to the back and it's a hatchback i'm kind of fascinated with the whole thing because it looks like nothing else that i've seen before and it's certainly one of the more unique cars at the show here in munich <laughs> 